Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Garmin Venue tutorial video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to install third-party watch faces on your Garmin Venue from the Garmin Connect IQ store. So the built-in watch faces for the Garmin Venue, while they look cool and they're very sleek, they're pretty limited in the amount of data sets you can have or in the background images, things like that that you can have in your watch. So luckily, Garmin has given us the ability to download third-party watch faces from the Garmin Connect IQ store. These are watch faces developed by third-party developers and they are very customizable and can show tons of different data at the same time, making the watch more usable. So the first thing we need to do to install a watch face from the Garmin Connect IQ store is go to our phone and install the Garmin Connect IQ store app. And this is just a quick example of what it looks like in the iTunes app store. Once you have the Garmin Connect IQ store open, they have tons of different things in here. So I recommend looking around, including apps. They have different music apps. You can get widgets and watch faces for your watch. So there's tons of different things you can download to further customize your venue. Now to filter out everything they have by just watch faces, select the three horizontal lines in the top right. And then when the menu opens, select watch faces. But as you can see in here, you have tons of different options for things you can install on your watch. So now all we need to do is just look through the watch faces. Once we find one we like, we can install it. Now they do have it filtered out in three different ways. They have popular, recent, and then rating. I recommend going to popular. These are going to be some of the best watch faces available. And some of my personal favorites are going to be data lover, active face, and forerunner right here. This one actually just looks like the default watch face on the Forerunner 645. So once you find a watch face you like, just select it. And you have the option to go ahead and download it right here. But first I'll go through the layout of the information right here. So you can see how many times it's been downloaded and also the rating. And if we scroll down, we can see screenshots of what it will look like. We could select those and see a bigger image of that. Then below that, they have some information from the developer and then the compatible devices, things like that, and the permissions that are required. You can also see what people are saying about the watch face by going to the reviews. You can kind of see the rating and then what people say. So there's tons of information. Once you're ready to actually download the watch face, simply select download. The first thing we're gonna to need to do is grant the watch face some permissions because in order for the watch face to display things such as your heart rate or whether location, different things like that, it has to have access to those. So select okay. And as you can see, it says queued right here. That just means that it is currently waiting to be installed to our Garmin venue. Now to see the progress of that, simply select the back button. And once you see the emblem of the venue in the top right up here, simply select that. And that'll bring you to manage device. So we can see that in the download queue, Forerunner 645, that's the watch face I just installed. It's currently waiting to be installed to my Garmin venue. Once it is removed from the download queue, you'll see it down here under watch faces. So you'll see one. And then if you select watch faces, you'll see it in there. All right, so it was just installed and automatically it'll become the watch face that is shown on your Garmin venue. So there's nothing you have to do by selecting it or anything like that. The coolest thing about a lot of these watch faces is that they allow you to customize them. So to do that, we simply from the manage device page, go to my watch faces. And then if you select the gear next to the watch face, It'll allow us to first uninstall the watch face from our watch if we want to. We can also go into the settings and customize anything that the developer has allowed us to. So you can change the colors. You can also change what data will be displayed. So see how they have like content top field right here. Currently there's nothing displayed. I can go in here and I can select sunrise sunset and then go back to the main settings page and select save. And then pretty quickly, you'll see it update on my watch right there. So it added that. It just needs to quickly get the GPS and then it will display the sunrise sunset there. All right, so that's how you install third-party watch faces from the Garmin Connect IQ store on your Garmin venue. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Garmin venue tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.